no, uh, in the first half it was a mix of players who normally don't play and players who play. So, and in the second half it was also a mix. So we didn't uh, have a tactical plan to win this game because Simba did it fantastic in the first half. They scored a lot of goals. And yeah, of course we didn't want to lose. And in the second half uh, we tried to make the difference and we won the game. But I think uh, Simba did a great job today. No, no, no. Picking up from yesterday, uh, you told me that you don't know the team that you're going to face and you didn't have any time to search even from the internet to know Simba. You were planning to attack them by surprise. How did that plan work out? In the first half, bad <laughs> because they did very well and uh, I'm surprised of the level, how they play with courage and uh, how they really dominate us in the first half. It was very uh, impressive. But uh, in the end, they still have to grow because normally they should win the game. They give us a chance to fight back. So my big respect for Simba and uh, I hope they will grow more. Yeah. Well, uh, uh, talking about Simba, the, the, the level of uh, the game they displayed today, do you think uh, they have a future? Is Tanzanian football uh, having a good future? Yes, definitely. If you can score four goals against Fulia, you have qualities. So I think they need to work hard, believe in themselves and they are already the champion of Tanzania so they have to continue like this. And as I said, I was very impressed by them. I remember the list. I have to think of that. Um, I like the number 22. He was very good. He did a great job. 14 is good. He has number 8. I like them all, but these three players, they catch my eye.